nothing. 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 It's true, I have no love for streaming services these days. You will never find a more wretched hive of scum and villainy. So maybe it was my lack of patience in relation to cuties, penis rockets, or the lack of faith in the source material that Reacher somehow slipped through the cracks. Sweet Jesus. So time to butter up as we play with the forbidden fruits of a bygone era of television in Amazon's original production of... Reacher. This shit's gonna have nuts in it. Former military cop Jack Reacher rolls into the tiny town of Margrave, a small Georgia town of little consequence. Bet you go way back to the days of tipping cows and laying on a drug ban. <laughs> Until he gets arrested in the first five minutes for murder. At the station, he encounters a jaded former Boston detective named Oscar Finley, faced with a series of homicides in a town that probably when someone died it was a jackass moment involving alcohol and firearms. I shot him in the dick! You shot me in the dick! Reacher quickly demonstrates that his large physical appearance is matched only by an even bigger intellect. And a surprisingly quick erection for Stewie. As the story unfolds, Reacher begins to uncover increasing levels of corruption involving police, prison officials, local politicians, and corporate interests that make your average hooker look like a Girl Scout. Uh, is my dick showing like shares did? That's extra, by the way. <laughs> After his brother is killed, Reacher formulates a logical and cohesive strategy to deal with the situation. Kill every last one of them. Shit sounds reasonable. Unlike modern productions that would emphasize its more diverse characters rolling their eyes at the less intelligent toxic male, but like the main character, this show's having none of that shit. See, you're in my house, fat so. <laughs> A smartly written show delivering something for everyone with plenty of brutal brawls, gunfights, and plenty of eye candy. I like booty. For the more intellectually minded, it features extensive forensic analysis, critical thinking, deductive reasoning, and of course... EXPLOSIONS! Alan Richardson delivers a faithful performance as Jack Reacher. From his imposing physical appearance to his dialogue delivery portraying a no-nonsense man of action and intellect, who lets you know in no uncertain terms. Ever notice how you come across somebody once in a while that you shouldn't have fucked with? That's me. Veteran Malcolm Goodwin delivers a solid performance as a jaded, divorced former Boston detective who self exiles himself to small town police work only to realize. Jesus. And well aware he's not well liked or wanted even by his own subordinates, like Reacher, he makes it clear he doesn't give a fuck. I will put my fucking foot up your fucking ass until your heart fucking stops. Damn! And finally, Willa Fitzgerald brings a smart performance as Roscoe Conklin. Now, I know what you're thinking. It's a man, baby! Admittedly a man's name, but she's not what you'd expect from modern television. Oh, hot. Want to touch the hiney? Small in stature, but big on attitude and intelligence, and despite her physical size, isn't afraid to get all up in Reacher's business. What are you doing with that loofah? Don't worry about it. Ah! So with none of the self-empowering, stereotypical, woke wank fest that infests modern media today... <laughs> Reacher is a solid, action-packed, well-written story with real-life and death stakes, which admittedly left me disappointed in only one regard. It reminded me just how much modern entertainment fucking sucks! Thank you for watching, and as always remember, when they decide to clutch their pearls, we'll provide the necklace right here on Salty Buttered Bags.